families, thanks for joining me today with this language arts activity. The sheet that you see in front of you on the screen is the first sheet on the Wednesday packet for Wednesday, April 22nd. But whatever day you're working on this, please go ahead and do this activity with your child. We have done the tap method in class before when we were counting how many sounds were in a word, but I think it's good for them to review it and for you to know what it means. So in this activity, they're talking about blending sounds together and to see how many sounds are in the word. Each sound is going to get a tap with the finger to the thumb. So for the first word mad, it would look like this. M, a, d, mad. That way, the students can hear all three sounds. M, a, d. When you are doing this, it's important for them to hear the first sound, the middle sound, and the last sound. You might notice that all of the words on this sheet are all words that have three sounds. They're called CVC words. The first letter is a consonant, so there's your C. The middle letter is a vowel, so there's your V. And the last letter is a C again for consonant. So it's a consonant, vowel, consonant word. And that's how it is for all three of these. They really want them to be able to practice the CVC words so that they can feel confident in hearing the first sound, the middle sound, and the last sound. And then as we progress, it won't just be three sound words, it will increase as they go. So for today, and anytime you're doing a sound activity, how many sounds are in a word, then please encourage your child to do the tap method.